The surprises just keep coming on Impact Wrestling. Formerly known as WWE Superstar Heath Slater has just made his Impact Wrestling debut. Seemingly now known as Heath. I believe he's going by the name Heath Miller. But I think WWE obviously trademark the name Heath Slater. You can't use that. The commentators seem to just call him Heath here. Um, this was really, really cool. We just had the knockouts gauntlet. Obviously, people were wondering if we were going to get someone else in that. We really didn't. Um, there was a few little wacky moments in the match, but no one knew coming down. And then as the match ended, we went to the commentators and we saw Heath Slater behind them jump the rail, get into the ring and basically say, surprise! And I like that. Um, he'd obviously missed the Rascals Open Challenge. He talked about the fact Rhino is on the Impact Wrestling roster, saying one of his best friends works there. So I hope there's going to be a reunion for them down the road. Impact would be silly not to, let's be honest. We all loved Slater and Rhino, and I think they could do some of those funny vignettes that they used to do on SmackDown, you know, where uh, Rhino would sit there eating um, cheese and Slater would talk about his kids and stuff. They could do that in Impact. Why not? It would still be fun. People know that. This is, again, the second big surprise of the night. We already had Motor City Machine Guns start the show. That was huge, absolutely huge. If you're a TNA original fan, you know Saban, you know Shelley. That was epic to see them back. But I think this one, Heath Slater will get people talking. Obviously, he appeared on Raw really not that long ago, um, literally in a segment with a WWE champion. Okay, it was a squash match, but that promo he cut really built up his stock. We said it at the time, people would be interested in Heath now because... Before, yet yeah, he was an okay superstar. People liked him. WWE really didn't do much with him. Now, he said it. He's in Impact Wrestling to make an impact. And that's exactly what he's going to do. I can't wait to see what's next for him. I hope he gets like the Drew McIntyre treatment. I hope that he spends a year or two in Impact. Maybe wins the world title eventually. Builds his like name up. To the point where he can maybe go back to WWE. It's kind of strange to say that. But I kind of got to feel like that could be a target of his. To one day go back to WWE. And follow in the footsteps of his former 3MB teammates. Jinder Mahal, Drew McIntyre. And become WWE Champion. Could you imagine that? It would be poetry in motion. It would be awesome. But let me know your thoughts on Slammiversary so far. And he's debut on impact wrestling of course like the video if you are new to the channel hit the subscribe button you can follow me on twitter instagram at c wrestling uk make sure you are subscribed with the notifications on because we'll be doing these videos throughout the night and tomorrow for extreme rules and of course we got the extreme rules chill zone at the same time so make sure you tune in for that i will see you as always next time peace